Hi guys, it's Julie from Just Beauty with Julie. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be filming a quick or maybe not so quick haul. I have some products that I got from Sephora and then I have some products that I got from She Glam. So I just wanna show you what I purchased and hopefully you guys will give me some comments below to let me know like what, what products you wanna see in a video, like sooner than later. So um, if this is something that you would wanna see, please stay tuned and watch the video. I'm going to start with Sephora. I purchased, <laughs> and I, ho I hope I find a different word, but I purchased Gucci the Serum Debut Mattifying Primer Shine Control. This came out, I think, maybe like a month ago. I don't know how it works. I never used it before. I'm just going to put a little bit on. I'm going to see what it feels like. It's got like a gel consistency. But anyway, I purchased that. And then I repurchased the Gucci foundation. I got it in a lighter color because I had this color, which was 460 in, and this one is 440 O. So I'm going to try this one. That's why I never did a video with this one because it was too dark. So we're going to try this one. Okay, I'm going to go quick because I have a lot of products. Both of them are supposed to be good products. I heard really good things about them. So we're going to try them very soon. The products keep coming out so fast, I don't get a chance to try everything. I buy stuff and then it's sitting on a shelf and I'm gonna do a video with everything that I purchased because I have so much stuff that I never use. I purchased this Makeup Forever HD foundation. This is the new one. I actually am wearing it now. You're gonna see it in an upcoming video. This is the color 4N68. I did a first impressions video. It'll be coming up soon so you can see my thoughts on this foundation. I also purchased the Kosas Revealer Skin Improving Foundation. It has a SPF of 25. This is in the color Deep Neutral Warm, number 410. This is deep with natural golden undertone. Of course, I never tried it. It'll be coming up in a video soon. I think I have like a powder by Kosas, but I don't even know if I ever used it. And I also have their new concealer. I heard really good things about the foundation. I will be going through these products pretty quickly. So what I'll do is I will put the price of each product on the screen. This is the Kosas Revealer Super Creamy Brightening Concealer. I have it in the color 8.2W. This is deep with golden undertones. This is what it looks like. I will be using it in a video very soon. I also have this new Dior Forever Transfer Proof 24 Hour High Perfection Foundation. Now, I have this Forever Foundation, which came out, I want to say like, maybe a year and a half ago. I bought it last year, but I never got a chance to film a video with it. I think I did film a video, but as you can tell from the box, it's pretty dark. And it's so crazy because this one is in the color 7.5 N. And then this one that I purchased, I got it in eight because it looked darker online. But technically, they both look like the same color to me. So that's going to be a good side-by-side -side comparison video. <laughs> that's going to be coming up soon. But anyway, this one is supposed to be transfer resistant. They're both the matte formula. This is the new one. We'll be doing a video with that soon. I purchased the Chanel Le Beige Healthy Glow Bronze and Cream in the color 395 So Late tan deep bronze now when I saw it online I was like super excited because I was like oh wow they finally came out with a color that I can use well this is what the color looks like it's a lot darker than the original one you'll see in my video that's coming soon my thoughts on this product then I have the the milk makeup Hydro Grip Eye Primer. I also did a first impressions of this so you'll see it in the upcoming video this is a eye primer that you put on before you put on your eyeshadow so watch the video so you can hear my thoughts on the product I have the makeup forever HD concealer I bought it to go along with the foundation I have it in the color 4.5 it was pretty light I actually am, am wearing it right now you will see what my thoughts are on the product once the video comes out it's coming soon okay so I have a lot of she glam products I really like this stuff it's very very affordable but I love it so I'm gonna start with their she glam versatile flawless concealer and this is in the color chestnut I never opened any of this I couldn't tell you what it looked like ordered it all offline I don't know what the color looks like what the packaging looks like it's in a tube 
I can't wait to use it. I'm usually super satisfied with their products, but this is in the color Chestnut, and it says it is a versatile, flawless concealer. It's like a filter in a tube. The long-lasting liquid formula comes in multiple color correcting shades that, that brighten and conceal dark circles, redness, and hyperpigmentation. Then I have the, I might as well do these blushes. This is the Sweet Cheeks Blush Trio from She Glam. Cute little package. I like these colors. These are really nice for the spring that's coming up. Um, this is called Sunset Cruise. It doesn't have names, but these are the blushes, so I'm super excited to try those. This is another blush by She Glam. This is the lightweight matte blush. I hope you guys like my makeup. Oh, uh, this is super sleek. I like it. Uh, their packaging is so cute. Look at the color. That's a pretty pink. I love a pink blush. It reminds me of a favorite blush that I had from MAC years ago. And I still have it. I'm gonna show it to you. I gotta find it. That's a pretty like bubblegum pink. It says this lightweight blush brings out a natural looking dewy, fresh glow to all skin tones. The ultra delicate texture allows the product to glide on your skin and blend seamlessly for an effortless and even application. And this one, same pretty box. It's so pretty. I love it. It looks like high-end makeup. Oh, that's nice too. Sort of like a coral, like a peachy coral kind of color. Okay, I can't wait to try that. So those are the blushes. This is the She Glam Skinfinite Hydrating Foundation. I have so many new foundations to try. Okay, this is the She Glam Skinfinite Hydrating Foundation. It says, get ready for Skinfinite possibilities with our creamy medium coverage foundation that's designed to mimic the natural look of your skin, but sub in extra hydration and a gorgeous glow. Say goodbye to cakey, pore clogging foundations of the past. This Advanced formula is ultra lightweight, blendable, breathable, and barely there to feel. That's the box. Oh, look at that. That comes in a, a, a case like a high-end. Gucci has cases like this. Oh my God. This is so, wow. Very nice. This is nice. Now, I don't know if the color is gonna work for me, but I love this. Look at this. I see a video. I see a video. Very nice. Okay. I'm always impressed with their products. I really am always impressed with their products. I have another one of their foundations. This is called the She Glam Complexion Pro. Long lasting, buildable, breathable matte foundation. Did I show you the packaging? I think I did, but I'm not sure. Oh, look at that. Nice. Oh, that's pretty. Okay. I can't wait to use these. I really, I, I love their products. I really do. Okay. This is a concealer. This is the She Glam 12 hour full coverage concealer in the color peanut butter. That's the box and oh, that's really light. Okay, we're gonna use it though. I'm excited, very sleek packaging. Okay, it's so pretty. I have another one in a darker color. It's the same 12 hour full coverage concealer but this one is in a mond. That's the same color that I have from the NARS concealer. It looks totally different though. It has a nice kind of brownie tone. I cannot wait to use these. Okay, this is the She Glam Sun Sculpt Liquid Bronzer in the color Camel Suede. See, I never opened any of this stuff. It says, how to look as if you took the beach vacation you skipped. Our Sun Sculpt Liquid Bronzer will give you that post sun glow and coveted contour without harmful rays and ooh, days. Apply all over your face for a full tan or glide onto your cheeks and nose for a sculpted snatched formula. That's the box, that's pretty. Oh, look at the little packaging. The little, oh, this is so cute. Nice. Oh, look at that. It's like a sponge. Look at that color. You see it? Okay. I should have smelled it. Mm, okay. I'm super excited. I'm super excited. Okay, this is our last product from them. Then I have some products from P. Louise. Like, I really want to do an unboxing with them. Their products come so beautifully packaged. And I bought that P. Louise stuff before Christmas. And I just haven't gotten around to even really looking at it. This is the Blurred Effect Matte Lip Whip in the color POV. I had one of these before. I just got this one. It looks very similar. It's a nude color. But again, like I said, I'm very, very excited to try these products. I don't want this video to be too long. I just wanted to show you a quick haul of the things that I purchased. I'm looking at these P. Louise. Should I do the P. Louise real fast? Okay. All right. So I have the P. Louise Base Pro. This is the large size. So this is in the color Rumor 1. This is a, a high base. Yeah. That's like a pinky tone. 
This is room of zero. Their packaging is so cute. So that, that's the big version. Cause, Cause these are colors that you can use like with any kind of color. Bright colors. You know, you don't really want to use it with a dark color, but it makes the colors really stand out. This is their eyeshadow that I purchased. I really want to start being able to use them. I was like, I gotta, I have to um, introduce them to the channel so we can start using them. But they come in such pretty packaging. This is their Bank of Louise Stack Em Up palette. Look at that packaging. Isn't that box so pretty? It's been so long, I don't remember what these colors look like. Oh, look how pretty. I love that. Oh, it's purple. One of my favorite colors. I think I've been looking for a purple palette. Palette, so I can do a purple eye look. Can you see that? I can't wait to use these colors. This is their Secret Center eyeshadow. Okay, I don't know how many palettes are in here. Okay, it looks like two palettes. Just look at this packaging. Oh, maybe one palette. Is that pretty? Oh, that's so pretty. Look at that. I want to show you the colors. I love it. Is it just one layer or is it another one? That's it. It's nice. I love the colors. Okay, I think that's it says it is super pigmented, crease proof, opaque finish, and seamless blending. So now that I have introduced it to you guys, I can't wait to do some looks with it because you know I really love color. I really love color. So let me show you guys what else I have. I have these acid rain colors. These are like little paint pots, right? I took them out because I had so many of them. So I have all of these different eye Lord, these different eyeshadow bases. I think I have like about 30 colors and this is gonna really make like colors stand out. This is one of the, this is called Crisp Finish Sweet and Sour. It's like a green color. I just want to show you like a few of them with the, uh, I never opened it. I hope they don't dry up. It's like a, can you see that? It's thick, but oh, look how creamy that is. Oh, I can't, oh, I can't wait to, do you see how pretty that color is? Oh, I can't wait. I cannot wait. I cannot, let me put this aluminum foil back on it. I can't wait to use this. They have a yellow. I just want to show y'all the yellow. And then I'm not going to go through all of these, but I have so many different colors. I can't wait. This one is called Golden Treasure. Same consistency. See that? Look at, oh, I can't wait. Do you see that yellow? You guys already know. I love color and I have all of these different colors I cannot wait to use them I hope that you guys enjoyed our little haul I didn't want to start using them until I actually like announced it on a channel and showed you guys that I had these products I cannot wait to use them I hope you guys enjoyed this video do not forget that I am doing a giveaway I'm trying to get to 500 subscribers by the end of March so please share this video like comment subscribe Keep watching, watching, watching. I hope you're learning something. Please, in the comment section, give me some feedback. Give me some ideas of looks that you would like to see, things that you would like to see me, you know, do on the channel. I hope that this video will see you liking. I will see you in the next video. Please stay tuned and watch one of the other videos. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs> okay, thank you guys for watching. <laughs>